Along with technical progressions come better and possibly more dangerous devices for cyber criminals. The newer tool employed today, for instance, is drone technology. The potency of drones could not be overstated, especially considering that drone technology was initially designed for commendable purposes like rescue missions. Nevertheless, malevolent hackers have their own way of reshaping these devices to perpetrate their heinous cyber missions. In this video, we will share the most recent information relating to hacking with drones, elaborate on the tactics employed, review some preventive measures, then highlight the best defenses that could cope with this conspicuous menace. Understanding the use of drones for hacking. A drone-based hacking entails utilizing an unmanned aerial vehicle to penetrate the defenses, gain access to the systems, and compromise the networks through various approaches. Aerial Reconnaissance. Unmanned aerial vehicles are deployed equipped with high-resolution cameras or sensors to determine network layouts, physical security, access points, vulnerabilities, and more. Wi-Fi spoofing and deauthentication. Specialized hardware on drones can spoof Wi-Fi networks or attack the devices, which can be quite a potent way to interfere with wireless communications or open up opportunities for man-in-the-middle MITM attacks or a breach of a network. Physical payload delivery. A method used by drones to deliver physical payloads such as USB drives or small computing devices that can bypass traditional cybersecurity defenses and steal data from secure facilities or networks. Denial of service, DOS attacks. Drones with jamming capabilities could execute destructive DOS attacks, interfering with wireless communication or GPS signals used by critical infrastructure or systems thereby making them inoperable. Prevention strategies. In order to reduce the risk of drones executing such attacks, there are several prevention measures that can be taken by organizations. Drone detection systems. Install drone detection systems capable of using radar, radio frequency, RF sensor, and visual recognition technology to detect and identify unauthorized drones near a critical asset or site. Geofencing and Restricted Zones Create geofenced areas and restricted zones in which drone operations are prohibited or tightly controlled to prevent intrusion from unauthorized and bogus drones. For example, drones could be prohibited from flying near power plants or other critical infrastructures. Wireless Network Security Employ strong encryption too. Difficult to crack Wi-Fi code, set up network segmentation, and use an intrusion detection system to ward off Wi-Fi spoofing, deauthentication attacks, and other wireless attack tactics. Physical security. Increased physical security at facilities in sensitive areas, like cameras, access controls, sensors, and perimeter defense, can help prevent drone reconnaissance and payload, for example, explosives delivery. Effective defenses. Besides prevention strategies, effective defenses against drone-enabled cyber attacks include signal jamming countermeasures, signal jamming countermeasures that can detect and counter-neutralize rogue drones fitted with jamming devices to respond quickly to mitigate DOS attacks, automated response systems, deploy automated response systems to detect mitigate and prevent specific threats that were identified in reconnaissance activities related to the primary system in order to stall the attack and prevent unauthorized access or data exfiltration. For an example, if a reconnaissance activity associated with a primary system had identified a specific drone, the likely next step for the attacker would be to gain unauthorized access to the system through physical or virtual means. With an automated response system in place, this is less likely to happen because the drone would be detected in real time, possibly by perceived gestures, activity patterns, or noise indicator, and trigger an alarm which will starting physical barriers and issuing notifications to relevant personnel. Cyber, physical cooperation. Encourage collaboration between cybersecurity and physical security entities to develop holistic approaches conducting risk mitigation to drones, integrating cyber defense with physical security controls, at the same time creating a defense in depth that mitigates the risks posed by drones. 
In conclusion, hacking with drones is currently a top growing cybersecurity and physical security risk. So recognizing how adversaries work and being proactive with prevention and with effective defense is vital to reduce the risk of drone-enabled cyber attacks. Then organizations and enterprises can better protect their people, places, and property. Please subscribe, like, and share.